I chose to be in Ashland, mostly because it's a better fit for the type of healthcare that I would like to deliver. I grew up in a small town, and so I like the small town atmosphere and the way that you get more personalized care and more of a personalized touch that goes along with that. I did medical school at the University of Washington in Seattle, and then moved east to do my residency at Dartmouth, so up in New Hampshire, and then also did a fellowship in sports medicine in Aspen, Colorado. As an orthopedic surgeon, my subspecialty is sports medicine, which is mostly arthroscopic procedures, uh, so doing procedures that are minimally invasive. I've had the privilege of working uh, in Duluth, Minnesota for the last nine years, uh, taking care of Division I, II, and Three athletes, as well as some Olympians. Uh, and weekend warriors, uh, so people with a variety of different injuries. Arthroscopic procedures uh, are procedures where we're able to visualize the joint using a camera that's placed in through small incisions. Uh, so the nice thing about that is that, uh, that we don't have to disrupt other tissues to be able to get in and see the problem and fix the problem. So whether it's rotator cuff in the shoulder, uh, ACL in the knee, uh, or the labrum in the hip, uh, it can be taken care of through small incisions, which, help, which helps uh, lessen the pain and speed the recovery. Well, having a high volume of procedures uh, is in the orthopedic literature in multiple occasions where it shows that you decrease your, your complication rates and it, there's a pretty strong correlation just with the number of procedures that you do. So uh, over the past nine years I've performed over 6,000 procedures, so most of them arthroscopic, and so in doing that you become more proficient uh, so that you can understand where you can run into complications and how to minimize that. The reason the patient should come to Memorial Medical Center is that we're going to offer a unique combination of having experienced surgeons, plus having a hospital that is willing to support us with the most technologically advanced equipment, and then also having an administration that supports the type of healthcare that we would like to deliver. Uh, so having cutting edge technology, but still the personalized touch that goes along.